Go home, my people, and lock your doors. Hide yourself for a little while until the Lord's anger has passed. For this reason I say to you, do not be worried about your life, as to what you will eat or what you will drink, nor for your body, as to what you will put on. Is not life more than food, and the body more than clothing? Look at the birds of the air, that they do not sow, nor reap nor gather into barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not worth much more than they? And who of you by being worried can add a single hour to his life? If you humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God, in his good time he will lift you up. Cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. But for you who revere my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its rays, and you will go out and frolic like a well-fed calf's. And ye shall serve the Lord your God, and he shall bless thy bread, and thy water, and I will take sickness away from the midst of thee. And whatever you ask in prayer, you will receive, if you have faith. For I will restore health to you, and I will heal your wounds, says the Lord. I have heard your prayer, I have seen your tears, surely I will heal you. So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. For men it is impossible, but not with God. For with God all things are possible. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me.